Only one militia APC left, sir. Sending you the location now. The fools in here actually think you're winning. Deluded, Batman. We must get it from you. For a while there, I thought that was it. The final nail in the coffin. You saved us. Hey, Batman. How you doing? That felt good, rubbing their faces in it. Don't stoop to their level. We're better than that. Hey, we've been taking crap from them all night. They deserve it. I'm glad Owens is better. He's still worried. They don't know if that stuff has done any long-term damage. Let me tell you a secret. You haven't seen the last of him. He's gonna find you, and when he does, he's gonna rip out your heart. Okay, 25, October 30th. Come in. Tell me what you're doing. Sounds bad out there, Batman. Rather you than me. Agreed. I'm guessing you've encountered a few religious cults in your time. What's your take on them? They prey on the weak and the vulnerable. Sounds like my ex-wife's lawyer. Whatever you're up to, stop. Trust me, I'm hands off on this one. Cross my heart. Tape 25, October 30th. Got my hands on this forensic report. Human sacrifice. Tell me about this broadcast. Wish I could, sir, but it's on a SWAT channel. Encrypted. Those boys really don't like anyone listening in. I'm in. Hey, you hear me? It's Jim. I need you to send through some blueprints. I found Crane. And that bastard's going to die for what he did to my little girl. Was that the commissioner? What's he doing? Getting himself killed. But I've got the ID number of the radio he's using, and that means I can track him. I've decoded a radio transmission. It's Gordon. He's alive! I need you to isolate the radio's frequency and pinpoint its location. Of course, sir. The transmission appears to have originated from an abandoned shopping mall. The building has been without power for some time, sir. You may well encounter some obstacles. The remote electrical charge prototype is being held in the GCPD evidence room. That should help. Very well, sir. I'm sure Officer Cash will understand. I need to collect the remote electrical charge from the evidence room before I leave. Top had an umbrella with, yep, yep, a hidden blade inside, owned by Oswald Cobblepot, a.k.a. the Penguin. God bless Penguin. Gotham changes. New freaks come and go. But you can always count on that vicious little cockney to be up to something. One modified flare gun. One machine gun haphazardly duct taped to a grenade launcher. 
and one good old-fashioned baseball bat, all used by Dr. Harleen Quinzel, a.k.a. Harley Quinn. Without Joker around, Harley took over the clown's old gang. It was never going to last. One flamethrower and jetpack worn by Garfield Lens, a.k.a. Firefly. <sighs> Why can't Gotham have a normal pyromaniac, you know? Why does ours have to fly? Oh, there you are. Look, it's my stuff. So this is my memorial, huh? <sighs> Not even a statue. They think they can just file me away, don't they? I've been sent back for a reason, Bruce. And no one's forgetting me this time around. One vial of Titan formula. One set of wind-up explosive false teeth. One pair of actual X-ray specs. One toy gun loaded with one toy flag and five real bullets. All used by the Joker. No known alias. It's one hell of a toy box. I'm glad no one's gonna play with it again. This ain't right, Brucey. My stuff's not meant to be gawked at. That gun should be out there sticking up old ladies. That dynamite should be bringing the roof down on a kindergarten. All that senseless misery going to waste. One stuffed bear in a canister of Titan formula. Owned by Bane. AKA unknown. Do you know how long it takes to make an explosive set of chattering teeth? I hope you enjoyed the joke. I did it all for you. My guess, he's off somewhere getting clean. And he's not going to be happy when he comes back. One custom tailored top hat, worn by Jervis Tetch, AKA the Mad Hatter. The guy's mad, all right. He tried to brainwash Batman in Arkham City. <laughs> he got the Wonderland kicked out of him instead. I hated letting him go. This guy's too creepy to stay free. One rifle and two wrist-mounted guns used by Floyd Lawton, AKA Deadshot. <sighs> Another guy we had to let go after Arkham City got shut down. Still, that doesn't mean he got his toys back. One Arkham Asylum branded shock collar, worn by Killer Croc, AKA Waylon Jones. We found this thing in the sewers under Arkham City. And that ain't good, cause it was supposed to keep that bastard under control. Two ceremonial swords used by Rosh, I mean, Rish Al Ghul. We found these at the bottom of Wonder Tower the night of Protocol 10. They were covered in blood. No body, though. A selection of body parts belonging to Warren White, AKA the Great White Shark. White got himself sent to Arkham on an insanity plea. He lost a few things other than his mind while there. Made the new look work, though, I gotta say. One freeze ray, used by Mr. Freeze, a.k.a. Victor Freeze. We, uh, had to stop playing with this after the commissioner caught us making ice cream. Freeze has kept quiet since leaving Arkham City. Maybe Batman finally talked some sense into him. One ventriloquist dummy, a.k.a. Scarface. This ain't the original Scarface. Is a Joker knockoff. Don't ask me why, but the clown took a liking to these creepy things. One black mask worn by Black Mask, a.k.a. Roman Sionis. Sionis never really recovered from the night of the Black Gate riots, the night Joker showed up. Roman was an old-school gangster. Joker, well, I'm not sure what he was. Talia.
I'm sorry. One ceremonial sword owned by Talia Al Ghul. Miss Al Ghul was a wanted terrorist and an associate of her father, Raish. But Joker got to her before we did. From what I hear, Batman put this blade to good work after she died. One Tommy gun, used by Peyton Riley, aka the ventriloquist. Or maybe the gun belongs to the puppet. I never really understood what's going on there. One mask and jacket worn by Anarchy, a.k.a. Lonnie Machen. I wasn't even a cop when this kid tried to hit Gotham. No one's seen him since. No one knows where they're keeping him. I guess the government don't like anarchists too much. One electric charge gun used by Batman, a.k.a. We don't like to ask. Batman dropped this here with the rest of the Arkham City evidence. Nice to have some of Batman's gear in the evidence room. Obi doesn't ask for it back. One pair of shock gloves, worn by the electrocutioner, a.k.a. Lester Buczynski. Joker hired this guy on the night of the Black Gate riots, and then he killed him. I heard Batman borrow these for a while before handing them in. I guess he prefers beating up punks the old-fashioned way. Okay, now I can go after Jim. <laughs> Very subtle. I know this is the evidence room, Bruce, but you could have tried to cover your tracks. One laughing gas grenade, one snare trap, and one baseball bat. All used by Dr. Harleen Quinzel, a.k.a. Harley Quinn during a recent assault on the Bloodhaven police station. From what we gather, Scarecrow sent Harley to break out Poison Ivy from the lock of his blood. Any luck deciphering that message? Comms guys are in the dark. I ain't stopping him. Don't look at me. car just me and you batman anytime you want the fools in here actually think you're winning deluded batman i must get it from you thanks batman clearing the toxin finally gave us a chance to stick it to those militia in the cells it's been a long time coming let me know if you need anything You'll find him. I know. Good luck out there, Batman.
commander's here somewhere. We need to find him and shut this checkpoint down. I should find the commander's controller and shut this checkpoint down. that he's gone. Nothing concrete. I won't believe it until I see a body.
signal is coming from behind that shutter. I need to find a way to reach him. I'm going after the militia checkpoint.
All I'm saying is that he's got one face. One. It's just his two halves. I can use the remote electrical charge to power up or disable generators. comes for me, you're gonna need a lot more guys than this. Get in there or you'll be needing a wheelchair too. Batman's on his way. Stay alert. Why would we need more guys? He's just one man. I'm guessing you never met him. The commissioner's right. We're short on numbers. Where's everyone else? Downstairs in that briefing. What briefing? Something about how to kill the bat. What? He didn't think to invite us? Sorry, Bats. I guess you're not invited. Open the shutter! Now! The boss wants the door open. Huh? I thought the Bat took him out when he destroyed the tank. Guess not. Let's get these shutters up. Anyway, I'm sure a resourceful social outcast such as yourself can find some means of... No, you don't to open the door. I need to get that shutter open and use the battlefield to take down the militia.
it's any consolation, I'm sure Crane's put old Jimbo out of his misery by now. It's not like he's got anything left to be afraid of. Not since they sent his little girl on the stair lift to heaven. Now, if I was in charge, this never would have happened. can support the Batmobile's weight. An electrical charge would overload the generator and power down that fan. The generator is connected to a mainline power supply. The only way to shut it down is to overload it. Villains head off to once they've taken a battery. 
I would know, of course, since you never bested me. But do you think Arkham Knight's hanging out in some tacky dive bar right now, flashing glasses of cheap whiskey all over that nasty face? No power. I need another way to move it.
There's the generator powering the second fan. Now I just need to find a way to get to it. That's as far as the elevator will go. I need to find a way past the obstruction blocking the shaft. No power. That won't work. That's as far as the elevator will go. Oh, Batman, you've barely begun to solve my conundrums. In fact, Gotham remains riddled with them. <laughs> I've been waiting for years to use that one. Leader is wearing an explosive vest. I need to neutralize him first. I can't use any gadget that will alert the soldiers until I've defused the leader's explosive vest. Whoa! These guys are packing more firepower than Penguin. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? 
That weapons crate is crying out to be tampered with. So what do you think, ladies? My money's on the Batman. Though you could say I have a vested interest. Those boys have really done their homework. Where do you think they're getting their intel? <gasps> you think Barbara told them? Oh, those sidekicks of yours. A teeny tiny bit of torture, and they're all, please make it stop. I'll tell all Batman's secrets. <laughs> Gordon's just beyond that wall. I'm going to need the Batmobile to destroy it and reach him. If I can lower the car on top of that drilling machine, I might be able to move it down to this level. The Commissioner placed his trust in you to keep his city safe, his family safe. Can you still atone for your failure? Are you still the master of your own destiny? The answer's awaiting, Batman, as am I. The generator is connected to a mainline power supply. The only way to shut it down is to overload it. That's the second fan disabled. Now to get the Batmobile down onto that drill.
That's as far as the winch can take me. Looks like we're trapped up here. <laughs> That's as down as the drill will go. It appears that you are close to the Commissioner's location. Close, but this tunnel is leading me in the wrong direction. Dig up any schematics you can find. I'll do what I can, sir. Try not to get lost in the meantime.
I believe the exit from those tunnels is being remotely controlled by the Arkham Knight. Then I have to fight him. Sir, the Batmobile's armor and weaponry are no match for that vehicle. But I am. I'll find a way. You can't stop me! You're gonna die down here! Forgotten! In the dirt! Stop hiding! You can't hide down here! To end like this, Batman, I kind of hoped you put up more of a fight. Predictable, and you never stood a chance. Look at me while you die, Batman. Look at me.